counting down the top five reasons to love Korean dramas. Coming in at number five, there's something for everyone. What kind of movie do you like? What kind of dramas do you like? Do you like romance? Do you like comedy? Do you like action? Do you like prison breaks? Do you like high tech? Do you like murder mysteries? There are all of these types of genres within Korean drama land. And so like people are always asking me, what Korean dramas should I watch? And the first question that I have for them is, what do you like to watch? And number four, Korean dramas are high production quality shows. You guys, I have traveled all over the world and saw different countries television and some of it is absolute crap, but Korean dramas are not crap. They are shot in extreme high definition. The directing, the cinematography, the storylines, the money, the costumes and makeup, everything is spot on. They put millions of dollars into it. Things like Descendants of the Sun, You Who Came From the Stars. The production quality is so good, y'all. It's just so good. In the middle of the list at number three, Korean dramas are compact. Let me briefly explain what I mean by this. Korean dramas are like a little compact box. Everything that you want is all included in one season in approximately like 20 episodes that are aired uh, usually twice a week. You can easily watch it and not have to wait year after year after year for like seven episodes. Instead you get 20 episodes all in one bang and it's very easy to watch. Coming in at number two, Korean dramas transport you to another world. If you are not from an Asian country such as Korea, Japan, or China, then chances are Korean dramas are going to transport you to another world. Whether they be historical dramas or modern dramas, Korean dramas are definitely different from your everyday life. In fact, for me, not only was it different from my American life, but it was also different from my Korean life because it's a fantasy on television. And you can go there so easily by sitting on your couch or sitting at your computer desk and watching it. You don't even need a passport. And the number one reason to love Korean dramas is that the actors and actresses are absolutely talented and beautiful. Korean actors and actresses are some of the most beautiful people on the planet. I don't know how they do it, whether it's the attention to skincare, whether it's the plastic surgery, or it's the diets that they have. They are absolutely gorgeous and they are so ridiculously talented. Just as soon as you think that an actor has topped himself and Drama Land has topped themselves with the best drama you could possibly think of, they outdo themselves yet again. And there's great shows every month, every year with very, very talented people. Last week, whose K-drama comeback are you most looking forward to in August? Park Bo Gum or Lee Jin Ki? Over a thousand of you voted, and there were clearly votes for both of these very talented guys, but there was also a very clear winner, Lee Jin Ki for the win! For this week, which Korean drama are you enjoying more this summer? Doctors or W? Click here or the blog post link in the description, or drop your answers in the comments, and we'll find out the winner next week. Behind me are a few of my paintings including this one titled Wildflowers in the Rain that has just sold and is heading to Japan which is so exciting because I love Japan and I kind of want to go there and visit the place that this is going to but it's going there instead so cool you guys so cool anywho there are links in the description if you're interested in checking out and possibly purchasing my paintings there's one link there's also a link for twitch.tv slash hollyback where you can go and follow and watch me paint live Wednesday nights, K-pop nights, woo! Also check the link to this super cute shirt, which is down below. Click the like button on this video and click the subscribe button too if you haven't already for more Asian drama videos. That's it you guys, happy drama watching, see ya!